Ooh, my lip sashy. Oh, don't do that. Don't do that for the black girls around the world. Before we start the viewing of this week's daily vlog, I just want to let you guys know that WorkItGirlFit.com is up and running. If you're into fitness and fitness apparel, we got that for you. So go ahead and check out WorkItGirlFit.com. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm Tara Johnson. If you're new here, uh, thank you for stopping by. And if you are OG subscriber, I appreciate you for coming back. I told you guys that I'm going to start these weekly vlogs. I said... We're going to either have one on Wednesday, or we're going to have one on Sunday, or we're going to have one on both. It depends on how the military work we go. But you guys, I had to pop in because I'm starting to feel really sick. Like, I got sent home today <laughs> from work. i just been feeling so, like, congested and sneezing, coughing. My eyes itch. My nose is stuffy. Um, it's always running. I had to wipe it down. I stopped by my friend's house, um, G, um, so she can um, give me some some medicine because i started getting a headache my head hurt um and because it was either like get it from g for free or you know pay out of my my own money and i was <laughs> i was like free free it's adding up <laughs> free so right now i'm just picking up some food I'm at this place called Luigi's. Like, if you're ever in the Leavenworth area, check it out. I really like it. Hold on, let me show y'all real quick. Luigi's is also raining too. Um, and this is like a a little um, Italian restaurant. The owner, she used to work here, and then um, I believe the people that owned it before they were like Italian, and um, so. She used to work here as like a waiter and stuff. So then she bought it um, after they decided they wanted to leave. So yeah, kudos to her, girl power. So I grabbed my food. Sorry, that's my stuff that I just throw in there for work. But um, another YouTuber, that's my daddy and my brother. But anyway, another YouTuber was telling me about um, this website called Fetch. Um, and when you go and you buy something you get points and then it's free to sign up but her name is Gina my thick best friend on YouTube so basically you just scan and you get points and which turn into gift cards to like your favorite restaurants and it's just you travel I mean it's just you um spending your money on things that you would normally spend so let me see so I line it up do I get all three of the checks? Did I get all three? Yep, I got all the three of the checks. I submit. And your receipt is uploading. And I get my points. So I learned about this through her. And I'll have her information down below. But that's all I got, y'all. Supposed to be doing my rapid testing um, tomorrow morning at 10. So I'm gonna go get that, and they said by lunch it should the results should be back. So lunch is in the military where I'm at is like 11:30 to 13:00. So I should be getting it back that time. Man, now if you don't like mushroom, of course, granted you're not gonna like it. But when I first tasted this, I was like, is there meat in here? Because I told you that like I don't want no meat. But girl, there's no meat in here. And it tastes divine. Also got a Caesar salad. I always ask them to take the croutons out and add some tomato. I just like the Caesar dressing basically because I didn't change the whole salad. And then I got some cake that I'll munch on for the next couple of days. So this is the meal. It's really good, you guys. So check them out if you're in the area. I said I will start putting stuff up here more about Kansas City and Leavenworth area and all that stuff. So that's what I'm trying to do. The next... <laughs> See <laughs> next morning. There you guys. I'm gonna get my test. Oh, thank you. All right, and this is just saying that you have the COVID test done, and you need to remain isolated until it is resulted. Okay. Thank you. Have you done this before? Um. Yeah. All right. So you know it's terrible. Yeah. All right. Let's go. All right. I'm gonna hold on to you so you don't pull away. Okay. Touch your head up for me. Open your mouth. And here it goes. Try not to pull away. Ah! Pull away. All right, that's it. 
can we do all of our testing here? We okay. Have to give us 20, 24 to 72 hours for it to result. Is this for my eyes? For the tears for my for the eyes? Tears <laughs> Possibly, whatever. Oh, you know, God. It's all kind of crazy. <laughs> Sorry. Um, okay. Thank you. Sheesh. Y'all, you know, that test was something different. Like, I thought it was going to be like a nice little Q-tip to go up there. I think I said yes that I've been COVID tested before. But I don't know. Maybe I got something different because I don't. Or have I? I don't, I don't know. Like, I think I just said yes because I was nervous. I don't know. But that felt like something that felt different, you know, like it's not pleasant. She was like, I'm going to put my hand behind you just in case you fall back. I'm like, Man, I'm not going to fall back. Then I felt that. Shit. I was like, whoa, I said, what is this for? For my tears? Because Jesus. But you guys, to be honest, I really just think I have a sinus infection and my allergies are out of control. I just think they didn't give me strong enough allergy medicine. I, I didn't think my doctor believed me yeah i don't know so we'll see i'm gonna go back to my barracks and wait until i get a phone call while we're talking let me make sure that my phone is on ringer because i have a tendency of turning it turning the ringer on silent which would be horrible um because i'm ready to go back to work said no one ever but me i'm ready to go back to where i need i need to go back to where i got some stuff to do hello hi um, Sergeant Johnson. Hi, it's me. Hey, this is this is Pam at Bunsen. Hey, um, so your COVID test was negative. So I would just, um, I would make sure you kind of isolate, you know, until you're, you know, make sure you're fever free for 24 hours without medication and your symptoms are getting better. Okay, so looking busty, dusty, and crusty. I'm gonna show you guys what I've been working on. Um, I finished the thumbnail for my last video that you guys saw about CrossFit and you know, my haul and stuff. Um, so I completed that and then um, I'm working on Facebook uh, content to put up there on Worker Girl Fitness to show them some new exercise with the bands. I'm working on that. Um, I started cleaning up my room if you're wondering this is not a barracks bed i bought this bed because i could not sleep in that bed that's i just can't do that so i swept and mop and cleaned up and then this is the hall and i hung up my pc and my belt because you know i was washing clothes i haven't taken the trash out yet because um i haven't left out yet to go grocery shopping and I cleaned up and wiped down and bleached and mopped and swept and all that good stuff um, over here. So I wiped down, cleaned up. What's up? So, yeah, that's the bathroom. This is the door. I don't think I ever showed you guys. But that stain right there, I cannot get it out. I spray it down with bleach all the time. It's just like the wear and tear of being in the barracks and stuff. So that's one of the reasons I can't wait. And then I turned the light off so you guys can see if you can kind of see that little dirt. I, when I got here, I scrubbed. And you know somebody had like one of them mats down that like kind of like sticks. And it left like spacing and like the design in there. And I, I've been trying to scrub like I could not get it out. And that's once that runs out, I always fill it with like bleach and water. So I spray it down with that and then clean it up. So right now, you know how black people are. They be spraying stuff and let it settle and sit like that's gone. But that's what I'm doing. I'm letting it settle and sit. <laughs> and so then I'll wipe down the bathtub. And um, I swept and mopped the floor. And so, yeah, that's what I've been doing. Like cleaning up and, you know, working on youtube and work at girl fitness and yeah that's pretty much it you guys one hour later okay yes it's the last one too they have these uh vegan treats these are so good if you ever can get here try these out but they also have it in vanilla and lemon no vanilla and chocolate that's the only ones i know of but I like the chocolate one, which is surprising to me. So this is the place I like to get my juices from when I come into um, um, Whole Foods. It's called Ruby Jeans Juicery. 
and they do have a reward system so yeah I got the detox uh, citrus and I added some apple to it you guys look what I found ice cream sandwiches from the childhood baby but dairy free almond milk too no coconut okay yeah these coming home with me so this is what I picked up so far I really love these and they're like two dollars you guys they even have almond milk pudding but I'm not gonna pick that up but I thought that was pretty cool if you have any kiddos y'all guess what i had to pause the vlog we just left out of uh whole foods but everybody has been hitting me up because your girl just got promoted well i'm not promoted yet but i made the list for staff sergeant so i'm super excited like this vlog probably has been all over the place in the motions but you see what happens when you just ooh, my lip sashy oh don't do that don't do that for the black girls around the world don't be embarrassing her huh Hmm. Hold on, cause you know, hold on, let me sit y'all down cause I can't be embarrassing the black girls all around the world. We make sure we a little Okay. 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 Bad enough my hands was ashy. Good gracious. Don't do that. Hold on. Hold on. But anyway, your girl. Your girl made the list for staff star. I was just thinking, like, I was like, damn, all my friends, staff sergeant, like, Ron, well, not all my military friends, but all the military friends that's like, like my neck of the woods of age. I'm like, dang, Rhonda out there, she made staff sergeant, you know what I'm saying? You know, like, that's the only friend y'all know, but. What is my turn? And it's my turn, y'all. See, this is why you gotta be patient. You know, try to always do better. Y'all, I told y'all I keep getting congratulations from all my, you know, uh, military family. I appreciate y'all. I really do. So, this is where I'm trying to show y'all where I'm going. So, I get all my teas and stuff right here as part of like my groceries and my herbs. And this is the Phoenix Herb our herb company and this is in kansas city next to kansas city uh, university i believe yep so all i do all i do is bring in my mason jars this one has hibiscus i told you i'll use this a lot for like um my hair it makes my hair really soft so this is how it comes like this and i just want to add a little bit more and fill this up because I really love this for my hair and this is just the empty one for if I see like a good tea that I want so you guys let's go ahead inside hi how are you, hi, how are you? Good. I'm filming is that okay yeah, go for it. okay I won't put you in it I promise <laughs> Okay, you guys, I didn't film too much. She said I could film in there, but I didn't film too much. I got to get used to doing this, but um, I'm at the Harvest Moon Botanicals because I told her I wanted some chlorophyll, and they said that this place has it, but I wanted to show you guys what I wanted. I mean, what I got from Phoenix Herb Shop. Um, so, yeah, I wanted some jojoba oil, but girl, look, $40 for this um for this height right here so like this my hand whatever and i always get my oils like this because i use it for my hair i use it for my body my butters my whatever i do for my hair or whatever so i got some sweet almond oil because i'm getting low on that i got some shea nut oil which i love for my body and the winter's coming up so period i had to get that and then I also got some grape seed oil. The winter is coming up. And then like if I wanted to blow out my hair, straighten my hair and then have some grape seed oil. I filled up my hibiscus and I got some Himalaya salt for my baths. So that'll be good to detoxify my body. Um, and you know, soften my body. And then I got some of these incense. I wish that you could smell them because they are amazing. I got 10. And some people be like, incense stink, but 
y'all not black so y'all don't know but this don't stink to me it smells good it smells earthy it smell like the earth it smell like the land it smell like some fruits but you know it smell like abundance to me so yeah i picked some of those up and i'm gonna go over here and see what they talking about oh i also want to show y'all this is the place the fannies is also the place where i be getting my um when i be getting my uh fufu and uh okra stew dang the bus right there about to knock my socks off boy don't open this door look at them dang you know we in the city i might have to get out on this side i might get out on this side because i'm scared to get out on that side but look that place over there is called fanny's they got some good cuisine i'm gonna say african cuisine because i don't know what country and i don't want to sound too ignorant or already, it says fanny's african cuisine so at the top i don't know if y'all can see that but um i don't want to say where she's from because i do not know and i don't want to be ignorant um but the place that i'm going to is in the cut up there right th hmm, right there so it's it's right there something moon but botanica moon so we're gonna go in there I found this great place. It's black and brown owned and it's for black and brown people. But of course, all women, I feel like I will be welcome here. But I just found some cool stuff and I'm just so happy that I found it. But um, I just wanted uh, one of the employees are to, uh, to tell you guys a little bit about it. I'm not going to put her in the camera. So you guys, you know, bear with us, okay? Okay. Hi, my name is Granetta and this store is a harvest moon botanica and it's also a women's collective and a botanica of course is a holistic store so we have herbal medicines herbs so we also sell crystals and stones and tinctures sea moss and then the women's collective part is the black and women of color of this land are selling their products their business here and it's all natural products like body butters scrubs intention oils candles just it's just amazing here and thanks for putting us out there. down below we was kicking in like we was the bestest friend <laughs> but i just met this one i swear to god she's a beautiful soul she is too and um i really appreciate her reading today we don't we don't be but anyway so hello guys i'm nicolette with enrich yourself um as she said my information will be listed below and i am you know really excited to join any of you in your healing journey and guide you to enriching yourself yes and she does it um online as well so you can connect with her through her instagram and i'll put that down below for you guys and i'm telling you it was a magical experience and i will be coming to see her again thank you <laughs> all right bye you guys <laughs> thank you so much for making it this far in the video please like comment and subscribe um before heading home i headed over to fanny's west african cuisine and picked up my favorite okra stew and fufu with some plantains and then also for dinner i had liquid chlorophyll and i'm rocking my work it girl fitness so go on workitgirlfit.com and pick up some new uh fitness apparel if you're in the market for that but back to the chlorophyll um this is my first time trying it as you guys can see um so i will list some of the benefits on the screen but if you have taken it yourself and it's worked for you comment down below and tell us how and to contrary belief if it hasn't worked 
for you go ahead and put that down so we can all be aware and uh, yeah I'm gonna close this vlog out by just showing you guys what I picked up from Moon Botanical from the second place the woman's botanical I got mango butter because I want to make my own um, mango butter whipped up some chlorophyll and um, I believe I do not pronounce this correctly but I got this right here uh, and it's good for um, mucus so if you can see that you can go ahead and read that and I also got it in the leaf form so I can have it with tea I have a bigger bag but this is the one I travel with I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one be sure to like comment and subscribe and yeah bye